Hi, Caroline. Hi, Corin. Hi, there we go. <laughs> Hi, everybody else. How are you guys doing? Hi, everyone. Yeah. Um, all right. Let me just do my thing. Okay, hold on, Siki. So let's go on more. Coast. Okay. Yeah, I've just met your host. Let's have a quick test. Here we go. Things quickly. I think it's fine. It looks all fine. I'm just going to test that this video works. Let me know if you can hear the sound, okay? Okay. Hello, today. My name is Anita. I'm the Minister Division Manager here at Fertile Hotel Cougar Gate. Can you? Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, great. Awesome. Great. We'll cool. start from the beginning. <laughs> I think we still have a few minutes. Cool. Um, yeah, we've got about four more minutes to go. So when it's 11 o'clock, we can start. Okay. Uh, yeah, we've got 22 online so far. So hopefully that will shoot up to 40, 50, hopefully. Lovely. <laughs> <Right. laughs> cool. yeah. Okay, so a few more minutes to catch your breath and then we can start. Okay. Okay. How are you doing, Caroline? All oh, good, your side. Nice and busy. Yeah. Um, it's very, very busy for the amount of business that's out there, I must say. I've, I've never been so busy in my life. But okay. um, yeah, all good. Can't really complain. So um, we uh, have adapted to this new normal. Mm. Obviously, would love to go back to the way things were, but uh, I think this year we are gaining some good momentum now, um, and hopefully that continues. Touch wood. Um, but I think next year will hopefully be a better year. Yeah, for sure. Obviously, you guys obviously also rely a lot of the on the inbound markets. 
Yeah. So uh, at the moment, you obviously just have the domestic market traveling, um, yeah. which which keeps us afloat, right? Um, but exactly. you'd like the internationals to come and visit. Um, yes. So and then we obviously use the opportunity to, you know, to renovate, clean up, um, you know, do what we can to make ourselves ready for when everything do go back, hopefully, to um, not normal. I don't think it will ever be like it was before. It will mm -hmm. take some time, but just to prepare ourselves so when it does get busier. No, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. So, no, we're very grateful for all of the, um, the business that's been coming our way from, from you guys. Um, it's really helped us a lot. So, um, yeah, it's, uh, uh, I think with every little bit counts. I think we celebrate all the small wins at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> when we get the small bookings that we used to kind of be like, oh, that's, you know, overlooked it. And now yeah. we kind of, wow, four room nights. That's amazing, you know. <laughs> yes, every bit counts for sure. I know. Yeah. yeah. So, um, yeah, we're very grateful. So thank you so much. Awesome. I've just changed my uh, screen view and um, just okay. to present the mode. I just wanted to make sure that it hasn't changed on your side. No, it's all still good. Um, nice full screen, everything quite clear. And we can also hear you nicely. So thank you. We've got 58 participants counting now, 60. So welcome everybody to this morning's training. Um, I'd like to welcome Caroline um, from Marriott. She's going to be presenting the actual Protea of our Marriott Kruger Gate to us. So we're looking forward to, to this beautiful property, to, to share the knowledge. And, and obviously in, uh, today's training is a presentation, but also a little bit different. Caroline will tell us more, but uh, we've got little video clips um, cut in as well to give us a virtual idea of what things look like at Project Alba uh, Kruger Gate, uh, to give us an overall experience like we're actually there. So thank you, Caroline. Thanks, Karen, and thanks everyone for, for tuning in to um, my little training today. Um, this is definitely the first time that we are trying this kind of a, a training, so um, you are definitely the guinea pigs um, for this, so uh, thanks for, for uh, being the guinea pigs. Um, just a disclaimer, if uh, the technology fails me, I'll just uh, kind of walk through uh, the hotel with you. But um, I think the sound should hopefully be loud enough. Um, it is filmed with a cell phone. It was done yesterday. Um, so it is a more amateur video clips. Um, so just bear with us, but it, it does give you a very good uh, indication of, of what has changed at the hotel from the refurbishment that happened a year ago. Um, and then obviously it shows you the different room types, which I think is really good to know and how many packs can actually fit in each room. Okay, so I'm going to kick it off with the first video um, with the lovely Anita who's our rooms division manager at the hotel. And um, we've got a couple of clips um, attached to some of the slides. And um, I hope that you enjoy it. And then I will just update you with a couple of extra facts as we go through. Okay. Hello, good day. My name is Anita. I'm the rooms division manager here at Pratia Hotel Cougar uh, Allow me to show you our reception area where we're welcoming our loyal guests and of course our top VIPs with Marriott. And as you can see, this space is very great to allow social distancing. Another great fact that I would like to share with you is that we're only a hundred meters from the Kruger Park, so ideal locations for a getaway. Please allow me to show you the rest of the hotel as well. Okay, so just to reiterate as well, from a um, commitment to clean perspective, all of our hotels have really got strict measures in place. Um, so when the guest checks in, you'll see they've got the transparent um, hanging um, division boards. Uh, we've got sanitizing um, stations all over the hotel. And then we've also got um, a, a process in place where the guest will uh, opt in or out for rooms to be made up. 
So the reason for that is if someone doesn't want, uh, you know, a um, uh, someone to come in and clean their room every day, they can actually say, no, they don't want that, um, you know, person coming in and out of their room each day. So that is something um, just in case your guests do uh, ask why that happens. Obviously, when COVID hit, that was something that we introduced at all of our hotels. Um, if they don't have the rooms made up, uh, they cancel phone for any amenities that they need, and that will be dropped uh, outside uh, the room. Okay. So as you um, might know, the position of the hotel is 100 meters from the entrance of the Paul Kruger gate. So really, really fantastic um, positioning. It overlooks the Sabi, the banks of the Sabi River. Um, and, you know, just from a picturesque point of view, you cannot get better than this. I mean, that elephant is not um, photoshopped in. That is a real photograph. Um, so, so the hotel really is popular. We've actually just been fully booked over um, this past weekend, which was fantastic. Um, but it's, its position is really fantastic. It's 105 Rand, I think, to enter the um, Paul Kruger gate into the actual uh, Kruger Park, um, and that is for SA residents. Okay, and then just as I mentioned, there was a full refurbishment of the public spaces. That picture that you see there is our infinity pool and obviously the ebony deck, which is um, one of the new additions of the refurb. Okay. So in total, we now have 145 rooms. With the refurbishment, we added an extra 38 larger rooms, three executive suites and a presidential suite. So when it comes to the larger guest rooms and, and the, well, the new addition rooms, that whole area is actually on a completely separate side um, of the hotel's um, premises. The reason for this being built separately is this is purely for um, couples uh, that are trying to get away from, from it all. Um, and so anything that is kind of kids related uh, will still remain on the uh, normal side of the hotel. Uh, so for peace and quiet and couples romantic getaways, it's really a fantastic option is to book the larger guest rooms or the executive suites um, or even the presidential suite. Okay, so moving um, on to our videos. So uh, as I mentioned, we've got 38 new larger guest rooms and I'm gonna let Anita explain um, the look and feel of this. Okay, so allow me now to show you one of our large luxury king rooms. This is also one of our latest rooms that we've added to the property. So, first of all, kindly have a look on the bathroom sides that we have on the right. Wonderful spacious bathtub, as well as shower and a double basin. And of course, my favorite part is the king size bed and living room area over here. And also, of course, the outdoor seating where we have a wonderful table and chairs over there. This specific room is basically for our couples that would like to spoil themselves a little bit more. And uh, perfect setting, perfect, comfortable, luxury with a bit of mix of bushveld feel. Okay, so just um, in terms of the supplement um, fee, it's 750 Rand supplement upgrade from the normal standard guest rooms for this particular room. Um, so from a pricing point of view, it, I think it's really fantastic for what you get. It's really a great couples getaway for a luxury, um, a luxury room type. Okay. Then moving on to um, the double king option. So we've obviously got 20 of these um, and really great for either four adults or a family of four. So allow me to show you one of our double king rooms. Perfect for families. Please join me. So once you enter, over here we have the bathroom. And then this, of course, is the wonderful room. As you can see, we have two keys. They can either be for two couples or 
four single rooms. You have the wonderful view outside, which is always to the bush part. And then, of course, over here, you have your wonderful flat screen TV and always the mini fridge. Okay. Moving into um, the normal guest room, um, I'll let Anita take you through that one as well. So, once again, allow me to show you one of our standard rooms here at the Forte Hotel. Please join me. So, these rooms are very lovely in size. Of course, you have the bathroom over here. And, of course, as I mentioned, the king. This is perfect for, let's say, a couple. We can also add one child here below the age of 12. Again, wonderful view towards the bush belt. And, of course, TV over here and mini fridge as well. Wonderful, comfortable experience for you and your beloved second. Okay. Uh, then just moving on to um, a, just a visual of the twin setup, which is obviously the two single beds that we can still do. And then that still remains to have the sleep couch as well. Okay, then um, this is also a very, very popular room type is our guest room, which has got the two uh, queen bed options in it. Also very um, popular for families. Welcome once again. So allow me to show you one of our family rooms, which have two queen beds. Once again, we have the bathroom on the right hand side. Please allow me to bring you through. So over here, we have the two queen beds. Once again, fantastic for families or three adults, which is very comfortable. We have a magnificent view outside to the bushroom as well. With a little seating area, you have your air conditioning over here, your TV, your coffee setups, and of course, always the mini fridge. And last but not least, we have interleading rooms for the family rooms and standard rooms where we can arrange this for bigger families as well. Okay, so also just to reiterate, um, in this particular room type, to have the two kids um, that can stay in the queen bed as well. Um, and then the policy still remains the same throughout all of our hotels that kids under 12 stay and eat for free. So all of the rates that um, we have in the system with you guys are on dinner, bed and breakfast. So that would be on, as you would call a half board. Um, situation. Okay, so that would be the rooms. Then moving on to the coffee shop and deli. So this was part of the new addition uh, with the refurbishment. And with this, I think it's a really great um, value add when it comes to the game drives. Um, so between five and seven in the morning, they offer complimentary coffee and rusks on the go. Um, it's all on self-service, so um, they have this open, so you can literally grab your coffee. It opens 30 minutes before the park. Uh, grab your coffee and your rusk and, um, and head to the park uh, with your on-the-go coffee and rusks. Okay. Um, and then moving on to the gym, so they also added a brand new state-of-the-art gym facility for those people who still want to keep fit, uh, even though they are on holiday. So this is really um, quite a nice uh, addition, I think, um, from a leisure perspective. Um, and then moving on to the pool bar, we obviously saw the visual of the infinity pool before, but that's quite a nice visual, which shows you all the way through to um, D spa. Um, but in terms of, uh, light meals that are served here, um, which is on the a la carte side. They obviously serve the drinks. Um, and then just to reiterate how the pool works. So this is more um, the adult pool. And then they still have, which is kind of just down the side um, on the walkway on the ramp. And they still have got the kiddies pool, which is separate. So if you are on a couple's getaway, and you want to just relax and not have the chaos of too many kids, you um, have this as the kind of the adult pool and then the kids are able to have um, exclusivity of their own kiddies pool. Okay. 
Well, welcome to my favorite place. So this, allow me to take you through. This is the pool bar over here. We have a wonderful setting for groups, up until families, and of course, couples as well. Over here on the left side, you have the pool bar, where you have our waiters making the nicest cocktails and mocktails for you. Perfect, after a wonderful drive uh, in Kruger Park. If you want to have a bit of more privacy, I would advise you to have one of our private huts where it is a bit more private. And of course, you know, you can enjoy the view with the elevated seating. Next, I would love to show you the view from our pool deck. So we are basically on the border of Kruger Park. We have a wonderful view into Kruger Park itself. And of course, don't forget the most amazing infinity pool as if you are swimming in Kruger Park. Perfect for a cocktail right after your day in Kruger Park itself. Please come and join me. Okay. And then just a view of um, African Ebony viewing deck. Um, so this is really fantastic to just have a, a you know, glass of wine before heading to LARPA restaurant for dinner or just watching the sunset um, you know, after your game drive. Um, what is great here, and, and just to reiterate just on the um, value adds that you get um, as, as Thompson's is you do get a drinks voucher per person um, complimentary uh, per stay, and that is redeemable at the Ebony viewing deck. So um, really great to, to utilize it for, for a sundowner before going to dinner. Okay, um, then just moving on to the LARPA restaurant. So this is really, you know, quite an experience to, to, um, to have under the African kind of the stars. Um, they, they've added the uh, cold room, which you'll see on the right hand side there when they did the refurbishment. And what this actually does is it keeps all of the, um, the foods cold that are obviously sensitive to, to heat. So with being in the bush um, with those wonderful 40 degree uh, evenings that can, can skyrocket, um, they found that it, it was quite um, difficult to keep the foods fresh. So they actually built this cold room. So it's literally um, just a across the visual there, uh, past the tables under that little LARPA area uh, that you walk in and it's, it's quite a cold room that you can collect your salads or uh, comes uh, seafood, anything from like a starter point of view, as well as the desserts and breads that will all be um, placed in, inside the cold room. And it just keeps everything fresh and um, quite a nice addition, I think, and much needed addition to the hotel. Um, in terms of the hot food, so that still remains exactly the same. They've got everything that your heart can desire, um, every meat under the sun, the food and the cooking in, in this hotel is something out of this world. I must say, I went uh, last year, August, and it was such a great experience. Um, and I think from a COVID point of view, it's also good to understand how that all works. Um, so when you, when you go up to dish for your food, you have to obviously wear a mask um, and you don't physically touch any of the ladles um, to, to um, dish your food yourself. You would then ask them to, to dish and the guys on the other side would dish that up for you. Um, and then you would go back and sit down and then you would obviously remove your mask. So it was good to experience that. It worked really well. And it's, and the guys were quite strict um, about the COVID uh, protocols um, when I was there. So it's good to see. The food was divine as well. Okay, so that is a LARPA restaurant. Okay. Um, then to touch on the presidential suite that I mentioned earlier, this is the Nkanyi suite, um, AKA presidential experience. Um, so also a new addition to the hotel. Um, it does have two bedrooms inside the actual um, presidential suite. 
And then you've got access to interleading executive suites. So if you are a larger family and don't necessarily fit into the two uh, bedrooms inside the actual Nkanyi suite, you would then have access to the executive suites, um, you know, adjacent to um, or alongside this presidential suite. And it works really well. Um, the hotel's got, I mean, the presidential suite has got its own plunge pool, its own bright area, its own kitchenette. Um, you can request your own butler as well um, if you would like your food prepared for you. Um, it's quite an amazing kind of five-star experience. Um, and you really have kind of your own privacy and experience inside your own space, um, which is lovely. Okay. So that gives you a really good idea of the inside space. So that is the living area that you see on the left-hand side and then the bedroom area on the right-hand side. And then just to add in um, just the, um, the newly added conference facilities that they've also just refurbished. And then what all the ladies love is a good spa session. Um, good to know that D Spa has um, definitely uh, upgraded in such a big way where before they only had the treetop spa, um, which was amazing with the, the ladies, they are fantastic, but there was definitely a demand for more spa treatments. So what they did when they refurbished is they added um, a new building for the spa, which has got obviously the Manny's and Petty's area. And then they've still got the, the treetop spas, but they've added additional huts, which I'll take you through now. So once again, welcome. Allow me to take you through to our spa, which is in the heart of the jungle as well. Please allow me to share with you something very special. So this is D Spa. This is our famous spa. Uh, we also have three treatment rooms as well as a tree house. Exactly. Thank you so much. As well as a tree house where we like to have a couple treatments uh, overlooking the Kruger Park. The spa is also very famous for one of their unique signature treatments, which is called Chikia. And definitely something worth I would recommend to do when you are able to come and visit us here at Protea Hotel Kruger Gate. Kindly go through to the front. I would like to show you one of our private treatment rooms. Once again, as mentioned and promised, this is in the heart of Kruger Park. You have over here your privacy where you can do either a couple treatment or, of course, a single treatment. Once again, it is overlooking the wonderful Kruger Park where you can also see the Salvi River. Again, definitely a treat I would highly recommend. Perfect. Okay, so all of the um, treatment rooms do have air conditioning. And then the visual on the left hand side is the treetop um, room, well, the, not, not the room, but the treetop that you see. Um, and it's literally to the left hand side of those treatment rooms that you go up kind of a, a little a staircase into the actual treetops. Um, and it really is a phenomenal experience. And as they said, you can ha have a treatment there as a couple and it feels like you're inside the Kruger Park. It's fantastic. Oh, and one thing to also reiterate is one of the value adds here is um, you've got a 20% discount on the spa as part of the Thompson's value adds in the state pay. Okay. And then um, the African BOMA um, is really great for any of those. And I know we've had a couple of, of uh, small wedding requests and stays um, coming out of Cape Town. 
Um, so we've got this wonderful BOMA experience, which can be utilized for small family dinners um, or weddings. And it's it seriously seems to work so well. And we've had rave reviews on the on um, anyone who uses this area. So it's basically just past the spa. Um, there's like a walkway that takes you down to this BOMA and it's literally inside the Kruger Park. Um, so we'll have rangers that literally will sit uh, around, will stand around the, the circle, the encircled area, um, just to make sure that um, no wildlife comes into, into disturb your dinner. But um, it is quite an experience to sit and have dinner and listen to the wildlife um, within the Kruger Park. Okay. So I'm going to move on to a video now, which will end it off, which is a great video from Espresso that we did with Espresso. Um, and then I just want to, before that, uh, just reiterate the stay pay deal that we've got in place. Um, so the stay pay is a stay three pay two offer, um, which we've actually just got confirmation this morning that the booking window is being extended up until the end of April. And this offer runs all the way to the end of August. Um, and I, as I mentioned, the value adds that are included in that is um, a bottle of wine with dinner in the LARPA restaurant, 20% discount on spa treatment and drinks voucher per person uh, per stay. So um, I'm just going to click on this and enjoy the vid last video and then I'll take any questions. First impressions last and the staff at the Protea Hotel Kruger Gate definitely came through with a great one. The welcoming was fit for a king and really setting the tone for the awesome experience ahead. A great night's rest it was time for breakfast and I was spoiled for choice. Everything that makes a brilliant breakfast was on offer, but the X Factor had to be enjoying it all in front of Mother Nature. That for me was an experience like no other. Let's face it, no holiday is ever complete without a little pampering. And with a spa located along the Sabi River, I really couldn't have asked for a more tranquil and perfect location. First and foremost, I was greeted by Dee, who is such a professional at what she does. Hello! So I had the pleasure of being pampered with the Nopkiri massage. I was very curious as to what this is at first, but on the contrary, it turned out to be such a relaxing experience. There's just something about getting massaged in the bush. That for me was an experience like no other. Just what I needed to get ready and energized for the game drive ahead. saw a male lion just lying there but upon close inspection noticed that there was actually a female lion lying next to him the guide mentioned that it was mating season and that was the reason for them being so unbothered and relaxed we also got to see some kudu and just before the end a herd of elephants got a glimpse of a leopard definitely a fruitful game drive for someone who is so used to the hustle and bustle of the city it was so awesome being one with mother nature and just experiencing the tranquility that comes with it 
but I must mention right at the end of the game drive, we found ourselves driving side by side, king of the jungle. That was a 10 out of 10 experience, the perfect way to end a game drive. As the dusky night sky draws in, it's time for a magical African bush dinner under the stars. Experiencing the Protea Hotel Kruger Gate was such a much needed break. Ending it off with a dinner under the African sky was just the cherry on top. The food was amazing. I had a chicken stir fry which hit all the right spots. The ambience was to die for especially when the dancers came out and made us part of the entire experience. <laughs> In one of the most beautiful parts of South Africa, and I think each and every single one of us deserves to experience this magic. Even if it's just once, I'll definitely be back here again. This certainly has been an African dream getaway. Great stuff. So that is us. Um, if there are any questions, I uh, don't know if anyone has any questions. I'll be happy to answer any. I don't know if there's any in the chat box. Um, I see there is. <laughs> yeah, I'm also missing traveling so much. Um, yeah, I think, yeah, I think uh, it was a stunning, stunning presentation, presentation, Karen, and I think we all thoroughly enjoyed it. So thank you so, so much. Um, I think just from following your presentation, watching the videos, from all the unique little things that that Project Taba Kruger Gate offers, it just obviously makes it so much easier for us to be able to sell it. And obviously remembering that we've got our, our pay stay deals and all our value adds, which um, South Africans love. We like extra value. So thank you for that. Um, I've got a question. Yeah. And now we're 100 meters from the Kruger Gate. Um, mm -hmm. And I noticed also, obviously, there will be game drafts that clients can do through the hotel, right? And they can yes. do their own self drafts. Yes. Uh, what would the cost be more or less for a game draft? If you don't have the exact, just more or less. I actually have it here for you, Karen. I'm going okay. to, um, let me see if I can share it. Um, one second. Let's see here. New share. Okay. So I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. So um, so they've got different uh, options. Yeah, I can actually send this through to you. I don't know if that would okay. um, be yeah. beneficial, but um, they work through. Uh, I see this one is through Sandbox. They do have a, and, and I think that's the most popular one. Um, okay. Yeah. So um, let me just minimize you so I can see the pricing. Um, yeah. yeah. So six ninety per person, um, and then the evening same price, and then they've got the nighttime one. Which is okay, awesome. So the sandbox yeah. one more or less about 700 Rand. Those would be the bigger tracks, 20 mm. seater. Mm. And obviously the smaller and more intimate you go, those would be a little bit more expensive though. So yeah. Yeah. okay, understandable. So just more or less like we know what it would be like if clients would like to not use their own vehicle and, and obviously go with um, a guide mm. to, to take them with an open vehicle. Yes. Um, and do, do the property have their own entrance or do they have to go through Kruger gates? Do they have to wait at the gate for the gate to open before they can enter the park? Yeah, so they have to um, go through the gate and obviously it's, you know, with the times and everything, yeah. you, can, you don't want to get stuck inside there. Um, yeah. So, yeah, the, you would need to still go and um, pay to get in and get your form signed and then go into the park like that. Um, but what the hotel can do for you is, is um, you know, do that payment if you want to do it from there for the next day, if you don't want to. But it, it's really a quick process. I mean, it, I think it took us five minutes. Mm. You literally just park on the side, quickly run, uh, mm. pay for the access, and you've got that permit for the whole day. So you sure. can actually go in and then come back out if you want to go for an evening game drive. 
then you it's still valid okay awesome yeah um any other questions hi it's wendy speaking how are you good good wendy i'm good how are you very good thanks um you know the family rooms with the, the two queen size beds yes um all the rooms with the two king size i, I know for triple sharing it would be all right for three adults sometimes we have requests for four adults in that room type we do not recommend that because we do we do tell them rather take two rooms but i think they want to compare the costs if they have four adults in that family room yeah um, they don't recommend doing that um, and yeah. so then they would rather you know offer the um the room which is the double king um yeah. which there's 20 of those i think if i remember correctly um alternatively then maybe the the interleading option you know to have a standard interleading into the double queen okay perfect thank you sure house availability like for for easter do you still have rooms available um i believe the hotel is going to be full uh, what they're saying as of yesterday they've just got a couple of um confirmations they they busy um wrapping up but it looks like it's going to be full which okay. is really good yeah, yeah good for you um, and they were full this past weekend as well so it seems like um, people are wanting to be out in the bush, which is lovely. Sure. Yeah, I think a lot of people just want to get away. Exactly. Um, and obviously, we've got the, you know, sort of like a long weekend, not really, but almost <laughs> at the end of April. So we can always try those that time as well, that time frame. And then yeah. winter time, obviously, winter time, we've got our special now extended until the end of August, which is great. So that will help. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, awesome. Yeah, so that booking window um, was supposed to expire um, tomorrow. So we've extended mm -hmm. that booking window until the end of April. Mm -hmm. um, so this, that uh, <clears throat> actual stay pay is valid till the end of August. Okay. Um, and then we'll kind of see how it goes. And, you know, if, if that needs to be extended again, we might extend it. But it seems to be doing exceptionally well, um, which is great to see. I think the pricing yeah. is the right pricing. Um, yeah. yeah. For what you offer, obviously, it's great value for many. So very, very much so. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Any other questions? Um, I'm keeping an eye on the chat box. It doesn't look like anything popping out. So if there's no other questions for Caroline, thank you so much. Again, we appreciate uh, your time and obviously your efforts and your team's effort to put this all together and uh, we can't wait to go and visit ourselves and uh, and thanks to all our agents here that uh, gives us all the support we appreciate it and obviously yeah. thank you to Protea and Marriott to to offer us those brilliant packages so thank you sure no problem at all and I'll send this through to you Karen if anyone wants to know this and then I'm sure the presentation you would want as well yeah I've got it thank you Cool. Thanks. Um, but yeah, if anyone needs anything, um, everyone uh, should have my email address. Um, you're welcome to just drop me a mail. Okay. Right. Thanks. And Caroline, we had basically 80 people online. So it was a good turnout. So wow, great. That's yeah. fantastic. Thank really you, everyone. Good that's okay. really good to know. Thanks okay. for coming. All right. Okay, guys, have a great day. Cheers. Cheerio. Thanks, everyone. Bye, Bye Caroline. Bye. Cheers. Bye, Bye everybody. Bye.